All right, viewers, welcome back. We are now in the Enchanted Kingdom for... I think this is the second time we've ever been here. I don't believe it. Are you the one who opened that wall gate? Now I have to stand guard in case anything else comes through. Oh, he has a job to do now. And thankfully, I don't have to pay him coins. Cool. Well, this is the second time we... Oh, I almost fell down there, didn't I? That would be a terrible fall, wouldn't it? Wow. Yeah, this is the second time that we have ever been in the Enchanted Forest, the Enchanted Kingdom. And it is a lot bigger than I remember it. Holy crap. The last time we were here, we got our first Elemental Warrior. We learned a little bit of the tutorial, and then we just left. We never came back here. Even though we had a couple of warp gates, which we could have used to, like, teleport this way. So, the, yeah, there's going to be a lot of exploring here, Don. And is that a unicorn? Yes, it is. Can I do anything with it? Can I smash it? Can I blow it up? I doubt I can blow that thing up. I don't see any point why I should be able to. Yeah. They wouldn't let me blow that thing up. It's too pretty. Oh, a swan. I want to kick the swan. Haha. <laughs> Come here. I like pissing off swans. It's so much fun. Swans, ducks, same thing. Just go to a uh, lake and just do it. And yet another unicorn. Yeah, this place is huge. And I can't go through that gate for whatever reason. All night helps me stay on top. Oh, here's someone we can talk to. If you snooze, you live Maybe. different tribes play different sports. But I'm the undisputed champion in these parts. If you don't believe me, just ask around. At what sport though? That's the question. I'm not playing with you. Um yeah, this place is huge. And considering this is the first time I've been here, I really don't know what to expect. I do think I've been that way, though. That's where I first went when I transported to the Badlands. So we already know about that one section. Over here is where we know about. And the only thing that I do know is that when I first started the game, there was a farmer who was complaining about his crops being very dry. Not him. It was this guy. This was my prize winning crop. But since my tools were broken, I've had no way to water the poor things. If they don't yeah, so this guy, I'm probably going to need deep blue. Deep blue. So just spray everything. Okay, one. Those didn't really look like good plants, though. They look like spinies, like they could hurt. Okay, three, and it looks like two more. Come on, replenish. There we go. That's what I love about this game. You don't have to, like, go out and search for things to restore your magic. It just automatically happens. Yay, oh, strawberry. That's amazing. The plants look back to their old selves already. I don't know how to thank you, but maybe this elemental fruit can help you along. Uh, it will. The one thing I'm wondering, though, what exactly are those plants? Please mind the flowers. Yeah, they look like they could hurt. You're looking well. Yeah. Oh well. Well, aside from that one strawberry, I really don't know what else to do. Maybe I can talk to this old hag in here. Maybe she knows. Maybe she has a few clues for me. Anything in here? No, a few coins though. Uh, take one cube of ice, add two beetles from a box of creepy crawlies, heat to 360, add Meepo scales to taste. So cube box 360 and Meepo for whatever reason. So GameCube, Xbox 360, and Meepo, whatever Meepo is supposed to be. Eat before the crust heals over, a dish best served cold. I'm sure that Meepo means something to someone. I just don't get the reference.
Then again, I've never played Grab by the Ghoulies, so maybe it has something to do with that. What is that? Oh, crap, where'd I get sent to? Where am I? Who am I? Okay, we are back at the Forgotten Forest Glade, okay. Okay, do not walk into any portals. They are bad. Well, we might as well go into every single house that we can. We might eventually find something. Anything to break inside here. If you're looking for information, you've come to the right place. Oh, you've got plenty of rooms, yeah? We all have to make a living. Aha, <laughs> figures. Um, maybe she has some information about the elemental fruit. Okay, apparently not. She just gives me information that I don't really care about. Wait, what are crystal eyes? Uh, crystal eyes are these funky magic orbs that affect your fighting skills. Some good places to look are the beach and the older parts of the palace. Okay. So I need to go to the beach to find eyes, I guess. Other than that, it doesn't look like this guy has any useful or pertinent information. And nothing I can smash, sadly. Yeah. Huh. There's gotta be something in here I can smash. No? Really? Okay. It's kinda sad. I wanted to break some stuff. Alright, now let's see. Where might some more strawberries be? Maybe I can pluck these for a strawberry. I get I did get a strawberry that way in the What was it, the Forgotten Glade? No. Oh, there's a strawberry. When Oh, and there's something to pluck too. They're so small and hidden by all the grass. See nothing this way. That's just death. Oh, it's another peacock. Come here. I have a very sick and twisted idea. Can I burn the peacock? Where'd he go? There he is. No, I can't. Too bad. Alright, let's see. What is around here? There's another transportation thing. I'm guessing I want to go in there. Um, last time I got sent to the Badlands, there were a couple things that I skipped out on. No, I just quickly used the trans uh, transformation thing. Transportation, not transformation. Let's do that real quick. Come on. Oh, there's a sign. Uh, the Dungeon of Eternal Life. Yeah, last time I was here, I just went straight into the transform... I want to say transformation. It's transportation thing. Can I get in there? Let's see. And there's another door. Well, I could probably use thermite for this. Just blow them up. No, I can't blow open the doors. Would have made it too easy, wouldn't it? I can't go that way, though. Can I blow up this door? No. And no flip kicking. And what is behind that door? Whoever it is is making a racket. Anything above? No. Okay. So we are going this way. Up, oh, enemy. Who's that? Okay, what is that thing? 
Uh, this early incarnation of the fearsome plant trolls is believed to be the last of its species, roaming the wildness in these in the last age. These sly creatures would ensnare a victim in their tendrils, draining the life energy from their captive and feeding upon them. Huh. Like their modern day counterparts, these plant trolls proved extremely vulnerable to fire. Today, plant trolls are fortunately no longer imbued with life sapping abilities. And it almost looks like he has a strawberry in his right hand. Alright, well, I am running low on time, so I will continue my search for more strawberries in the next video. See you then.